A new bill being proposed would prohibit federal law enforcement officials from having sex with people in custody. Introduced by California Democrat Jackie Speer and Virginia Republican Barbara Comstock, the bill takes aim at a loophole that has led authorities claim that instances of alleged rape and assault were consensual. It was inspired by a BuzzFeed news story about an 18-year-old New York City woman who alleged that two police officers raped her in 2017 while she was handcuffed in their custody. The two officers claimed the sex was consensual, but according to BuzzFeed, they have since been fired and pleaded not guilty to sexual assault charges. The bill, called the Closing Law Enforcement Consent Loophole Act, will target the 31 states that have loopholes in place, with Comstock saying, quote, this bill makes clear what should always be the legal standard. Those in police custody should never be subject to sexual abuse or rape from law enforcement officers. We can never tolerate predators in any profession. While there is currently no law in place that prohibits federal law officers from using the consent defense, this bill would allow for the punishment of perpetrators with a fine up to 15 years in prison or both. It is not clear when there will be a vote on the new bill.